heard a lot because it was the thing I loved the most, but they were using that word and insulting me with it. Okay, so I got called a Trekkie, which I guess when I was younger, I didn't realize I wasn't cool and like the stuff that I was into wasn't cool. So Venom is this uh, Spider-Man character that is uh, made of black goo and he has like big white eyes and really uh, jagged teeth. Um, it's probably surprising or hard to imagine, but when I was a little kid, my skin was even fairer than it is now. My existence from the age of 11 until the age of 17 when I left high school was miserable. So my hair was very short and I didn't have uh, very straight teeth, so I think uh, when people saw me, I just kind of resembled the character to them. And it was really hurtful because I cared so much about Star Trek and thought it was so neat and instead it turned into an insult and yeah, it hurt a lot. Probably the most common name that they called me was Ghost. Anytime there was a scary story or something, they'd be like, oh, and it was Hannah at the end. Not only did I get called ugly, but I had a bottle thrown at my head one time. I got slammed into a door. Started this whole insecure downward spiral of me as a teen going to tanning beds all the time and trying to be something I wasn't. You know, I did, I did really well for myself. Like I got out of that town. I got a master's from Columbia on a competitive scholarship. So thanks for, I guess, that shitty experience made me into a very strong person. It felt really good to just see it exp like just boom up like that. It feels like it takes the word away from them and now it can be my word. Kind of a thing that lingers and weighs on you and so that I was not expecting to feel so happy after doing that but I'm like overjoyed right now. You know we're all in this together we should be nice we should be kind to each other and just make it like as pleasant as possible while we're here.